Well, hello everyone. This is Zaviar from Green Team and we will talk about how the second test has been going on thus far as day three is approaching. For starters, England are certainly on top even though it was a great attempt by the Pakistani bowlers on day one with the debutant Abrar Ahmed picking up seven wickets for 112 runs and carrying the bowling attack. England had made 281 runs and seemed an average total, but Pakistan lost Imam ul Haq early and Babar and Abdullah settled, but the opener fell at the wrong time, but Babar Azam and Saud Shakil continued a rather surprising attacking approach. The day ended with Pakistan at the driving seat and raring to go on for day two. At the start, Pakistan looked shaky and wickets were tumbling to a disaster of a collapse, seeing Pakistan losing all wickets by lunch. Then early wickets to Abrar Ahmed gave Pakistan a glimpse of hope but England continued to pile on the pressure and managed to cross 200 over a span of two sessions. With the very important day tomorrow, the pitch has been much better after the embarrassment of Adrawal Pindi but it seems to be better for bowlers as the match moves forward. Spinners have found a lot of success in being able to extract turn and bounce while pacers have seemed to found reverse swing which was something Mark Ape Markwood was able to incorporate this morning. It seems that England will try to kill off the game for Pakistan and show a dominant batting display tomorrow. But Pakistan will be hoping the likes of Abrar Ahmed and Zayed Mahmood could probe Pakistan to a winning position.